If have ever had a website, you will have experienced things like updating your profile with I can for validation and so many other things that can get on your nerves. But that's just how our current domain name system works. However, Handshake is trying to change all that by giving us complete control of domain names and decentralizing each domain while taking power away from the popular gatekeeper called ICANN. We have discussed about several blockchain-based domain, including Ethereum name service and unstoppable domains. If you have not seen any of these videos, you can check them out right after this. Today's topic has similarities to those mentioned, but with some unique attribute. If you have ever bought a domain before, you would have heard of things like Icon Fee while buying or renewing your domain registration. This is just about to get interesting so strap up, we are about to go for a ride. But before I jet off, let me welcome you to Coinily YouTube channel, your number one channel for tech and blockchain product education. With that said, kindly note that the like button is the sponsor of this video, it's free, and you will be helping us get this video to so many people if you hit that like button. So please click the like button. Also we have discovered that more than 70% of our viewers are not subscribed to our channel, so guys, kindly subscribe to our channel, it's your way of supporting our efforts and encouraging us to keep working on this project. So, now let's take you for a ride. What is Handshake? Handshake is a software that aims to incentivize a distributed network of computers to operate and manage a new system for domain name ownership. You may not be aware, but today, website addresses are governed by a non-profit body called ICANN, which sets standards for what letter combinations can be used after the dot in any domain, such as .com, .org, .net and the many other varieties. Handshake seeks to replace ICANN's role as central authority for creating and issuing top-level domains with an open auction system operated by its computing network. Since ICANN isn't in the picture, Handshake believes it can offer an unlimited range of top-level domains. Furthermore, creating an alternative to a centralized entity like ICANN also has another important side effect. Over time, it could help make a group of companies involved in the management of domains called Certificate Authorities, or CAs obsolete. On today's web, CAs tell users whether they are connecting to a genuine website. You can see a CA at work every time the green padlock icon appears on your browser URL bar. For instance, if you load youtube.com, you will find a padlock icon on the URL box by the left that normally indicate the website is secured, and at times you might find a caution sign on that same angle for another domain URL indicating that website is not secured. These activities are the work of CAs. However, a problem with the current system is that CAs, through error or manipulation, can make mistakes in identifying a genuine website. The CA system also depends on ICANN to maintain a list of domains, making it subject to errors that could arise from central management. But while using Handshake, the verification that tells users whether they can trust a website would move to the blockchain, potentially creating a new way to manage one of the web's oldest resources. Let's look further into how Handshake works. To put as simply, Handshake is a system for distributing website addresses through auctions. With Handshake, auctions for top-level domain names are held every two weeks. Users must bid using Handshake's cryptocurrency, HNS, to take part in the auction. The winning bidder pays the second highest price, using a format known as a Vickery auction. These auctions are all handled automatically by the Handshake software. Guys, this video is sponsored by the like button, so if you still haven't liked this video kindly do that and hit the subscribe button to support our efforts. Okay, we are about to land our jets, but before we pull these gears, let's discuss some important component of Handshake. First is the Handshake blockchain. This blockchain shares several similarities to the Bitcoin blockchain. For example, Miners running the Handshake software compete to unlock newly minted HNS tokens by solving mathematical puzzles and adding blocks to the Handshake blockchain. Similar to Bitcoin, new blocks are added to the blockchain every 10 minutes. Furthermore, like Bitcoin, Handshake has a fixed 2.04 billion limit on the supply of HNS that can ever be created. Also, Handshake miners are paid 2,000 HNS every 10 minutes for performing this task. Second component is creating Handshake domain names. Handshake names must be claimed in an auction. It is expected that all possible Handshake names will be available for bidding within a year of the Handshake network's launch. 
Furthermore, a user who wishes to create a handshake name needs to check if it's available and then send a special transaction to the network that opens an auction. The network's algorithm will then determine when that auction will take place. It's important to note that handshake names can also be used in several of ways. For example, they can be used to point to a website, but they can also be used as an address for a cryptocurrency wallet. Thirdly is the name claims and name auctions. Notably, the 100,000 web addresses with the most traffic, as measured by Alexa, are being set aside on Handshake for their current owners to prevent abuse of the system. Owners of those websites can claim a Handshake name by issuing a cryptographic proof. Auctions are the main way Handshake names are acquired. Users can bid for names roughly every 14 days. Bids are private, and the highest bid wins. Now let's look into HNS token. The official currency of the Handshake network is HNS. This means users need to buy HNS to participate in auctions for domain names. And it's used by participants to transfer, register, and update domain names. The token have a total and maximum supply of 2.04 billion. With a current market capitalization of $93.9 .9 million. And a current price of $0.2. Let's wrap this up. If you believe the Internet's basic infrastructure could be better managed by a decentralized alternative, then you will understand the importance of what Handshake is trying to achieve. Whether they will be able to disrupt the $3 billion domain name registration business with a more trusted alternative is another debate. But the opportunity we will have with a sensorless and decentralized domain system is too good not to embrace. Kindly like this video to help us get it to as many people as possible and subscribe to our channel. We need to grow this community, so please share our video with your friends. Don't hesitate to let us know what you think about Handshake and let us know other project that you will like us to work on. See you next time.